baby. Um, sorry, did I wake you up? Mm. Uh, you had your ringtone at full volume. I'm sorry, hon. Yeah, um, still here at mom and dad's. Um, uh, everybody here said to tell you hi. Um, my cousins, my mom, my dad, my sisters. Yeah, everybody here is having fun and, uh, wishing you were here. Personally, I'm wishing I was over there with you. I'm sorry again for waking you up, hun, but, uh, I called because I had some really good news about your package. Yeah, uh, the package should be, uh, be there in about ten minutes or so? Yeah, I have the tracking number here on my phone, and I'll be sure to let you know when it comes by. Um, if you want, we can stay on the phone for a little bit, and you can wait until the package arrives? Or do you want me to let you go back to sleep? <laughs> Alright, I'll stay on the phone with you. No, I don't mind staying on the phone with you. You sound really tired. Were you up all night again? Oh, don't tell me you were waiting for Santa to come by and visit us, were you? Yes, I still believe in Santa Claus. Now don't you go start telling me that Santa Claus isn't real, okay? Santa's real. How do I know? Well, I just do. Well, Santa isn't all of us. I guess, you know? I mean, Santa is a saint, and saints are depicted as really good people. No, oh, stop complaining. <laughs> yeah, I know. Mall Santas don't exactly count as actual Santa, but, I mean, they do make good people to pose with for pictures, and they definitely keep the kids excited during the holidays. You know, I was thinking back this morning, I was wondering, what's some of your favorite Christmas traditions? Like, what was something that you did during the holidays? Oh, that sounds like so much fun! Maybe when I get back, we can try some of those traditions as well. When am I getting back? Um... I don't know. The snow is still not letting up. And it's probably not going to let up for some time. But hey, that's okay. Like I said, you know, there's a package that's going to be arriving to you soon. In fact, it's probably about uh, five, six minutes away, if I'm looking at my phone correctly. Well, one tradition that me and my family have is that we make sugar cookies and we give them out to everybody. And uh, we also open up one present. Um, on Christmas Eve before we open up the rest of our presents on Christmas. Yeah, we are one of those families. It's a lot of fun, you know? Because sometimes you get to 
either pick the really big present that you want to open up and can't wait for, or you want to open up the smallest present that you know you can wait for, but want to get it out of the way, because you don't want to open it up on Christmas morning. I don't know. It's, uh, it's kind of hard to explain. I'm really excited to come back home. I told you, I don't know when I'm going to get home. The snow's not letting up, and it's... Well, it's... It's Christmas Day. Even if I did get home, I probably wouldn't make Christmas a whole lot better. No, I'm not trying to be pessimistic. It's just... You know, it might be the truth. I mean, this is, you know, our first Christmas together as a couple. Yeah, I wish I could have spent the whole day yesterday and even today with you. But, I mean, <laughs> come on. We got that package that it's gonna be over to you in a couple of minutes. Yes, I'll stay on the line with you, I promise. Yeah, I know it's a little early for a package to show up. I, uh, asked for it to be priority because I knew that, well, I mean, I used to work for a delivery company, so, I mean, I know how the priority thing works. Gotta get those priority packages out before noon. And, uh, 8 in the morning is, uh... Well, you know, it, it's early. I'll talk to you soon. Mm-hmm. Bye. Hey, did you miss me?